This is a fraud on the American public. This is an embarrassment to our country. And President Trump is 100% within his rights. We cannot allow this to happen before our very eyes. Fight to the very end, and that's why Donald Trump's going to get reelected. The president is angry, and I'm angry, and the voters ought to be angry. Millions and millions of people voted for us tonight, and uh, a very sad group of people is trying to disenfranchise that group of people. If you count the legal votes, I easily win. If you count the illegal votes, they can try to steal the election from us. And we want every illegal vote to be discarded. Does anyone believe that this is possible? No! Because it's not. It's a statistical impossibility. You know, I don't know if these reports are true or accurate. Do you know that fraudulent votes were actually cast? Or are you simply saying, uh, we don't know because we didn't see it? Look, uh, what we are asking for here is patience. The end of the day after we file. Do you have any evidence, sir? So all we, you have to do is ask your questions of Clark County, yes, they're not and, and we will make sure suit. that uh, we and will continue the pressure. So we'll be going to the U.S. Supreme Court. Networks don't get to decide elections. Courts do. We're waiting for the United States Supreme Court, which, of which the president has nominated three justices, to step in and do something. And hopefully Amy Coney Barrett will come through and pick it up. The RNC has deployed legal teams in four states, including Georgia. Uh, we are going to file suit. In Pennsylvania. The American people want to have confidence in the results that are coming out of Nevada. In a similar situation, what am I missing, John? Where are you? In, in Michigan. I don't think there was fraud in Republican counties. You think we're stupid? You think we're fools? In fact, he may not have been defeated at all. We're going to allow the president the right that he has uh, to follow through with the courts. Senator, have you congratulated Vice President Biden yet? Why not? And he's going to win America. We will not wait to four years from now to, to change this. We are going to fight this now, and we're going to change it. I believe President Trump still has a path to victory. If Republicans don't challenge and change the U.S. election system, there'll never be another Republican president elected again. President Trump should not concede. Let's not have any lectures, no lectures about how the president should immediately cheerfully accept preliminary election results. Fight each and every one of these battles to the death. Should they then invalidate this? I think everything should be on the table.
he has tried to uh, certainly politicize the department, and that's what he's doing now. He's putting in ES people uh, uh, who will not, uh, he believes, will follow any order he gives, including something that is even illegal. Because we're going to go in the night of, as soon as that election's over, we're going in with our lawyers. Sir, what do you say to the Americans that are anxious over the fact that President Trump has yet to concede and what that might mean for the country? Well, um, I just think it's an embarrassment, um, quite frankly. Uh, the only thing that, uh, how can I say this uh, tactfully? I think it will not help the president's legacy. Are you being a sore loser?